I've never done a video game review before, mostly because I don't know how to do one. I don't know. Today we're reviewing Half-Life. Half-Life is a first-person shooter game developed by Valve in 1998. The player assumes the role of Gordon Freeman, a scientist who has to escape the Black Mesa research affiliate after it is evaded by aliens from another dimension. Half-Life received public acclaim for its graphics, realistic gameplay, and amazing story. It won over 50 PC Game of the Year awards and is considered one of the most influential FPS games. It was followed by Expansion Pack's Opposing Force in 1999 and Blue Shift in 2001, both developed by Gearbox Software. In 2020, a third-party remake dubbed Black Mesa was released with help from Valve. Physicist Gordon Freeman arrived late for work at the Black Mesa Research Facility in New Mexico. As part of an experiment in the anomalous materials section of the facility, he pushes a crystal into a machine called an anti-mass spectrometer for analysis. The spectrometer explodes, creating a resonance cascade. I mean, look at it. Look at those particles. Ooh. That severely damages the facility and opens up portal to another dimension. Zen. Pronounced Zen. Some of the scientists survive and urge Gordon to head to the surface where he defends himself against hostile Zen creatures like this this, this, and this, and these lads named the Hazardous Environment Combat Unit sent to cover up the incident. Heading to the surface, Gordon travels along an abandoned railway system to launch a rocket with a satellite which apparently will help to close the portal to Zen. Later he is captured by the marines and left for dead in a garbage compactor. He somehow escapes with this easy staircase made out of boxes and trash. Nice. Gordon arrives at the Lambda Complex, which is the old place where scientists learn the portal is being forced open on the other side by an immensely powerful entity. They have a developed teleportation technology that allows Gordon to travel to Zen, where he is tasked to stop the entity. And then, Gordon encounters the remains of the researchers who ventured there before him and defeats the Gonark, a huge ball sack thing, monster thing. Then, Gordon confronts the Nile and the giant baby entity maintaining the rift and destroys it. Gordon is summoned by the mysterious man only known as the G-Man, who has been watching his progress in Black Mesa, and praises him. The G-Man explains his employers wish to employ Gordon. If Gordon accepts, the G-Man congratulates him and places him into stasis to wait his next task. If Gordon refuses, he is teleported to a battle, battle that you have no chance of, of winning. winning. Rather an anti-climax after what you've just survived. The original game was made in Gold Source, a mod of the engine that made Quake. Also, the game has very low polygons. I mean, good look. The game overall works pretty well. The AI on their hand. Well. Remember how I said that the game overall works pretty well? Well, there's some glitches that really don't make any sense. Get out of my way, Mr. Scientist. The HEV. I don't know, dude. I don't know why you have to wear these ridiculous ties. Okay. Now watch this. Cool people don't need elevators. You don't need elevators. <laughs> Like I said, people don't- Cool people don't need elevators. I don't care. Come on. Come on. Not that way. Come on. Come on. Come on, I know you can get in there. Come on. Open the door! 
Come on. Thank you. Now move. Move! Oh my god. Wait, they have the same voice. What that guy was... I wish I was playing Black Mesa right now, because I have a stupid mod that plays the Bill Nye the Science Guy music during this scene. Speed run Half-Life without Crowbar. Okay, I'll try. Even though I'm probably not going to be able to get past that first part where you have to crush the window with the Crowbar, but... Let's see what we can do. Whose idea was it to make the anti-mass spectrometer go up to like 105%? Like, whose idea was it? Also, who found this crystal? Or your specimen. Now let's just yeet, yeet this thing in. But let's pull it back out, pull it back in, pull it back out, pull it back in. Pull it back in, pull it back out, pull it back in, pull it back out. Oh no, he's dead. Come on, I can squeeze in. Just gonna take that. Almost got crushed by that. That would have been embarrassing. That didn't hurt me. This game's broken. Okay, the crowbar is right here. Alright, you know what? Screw this. Gordon cannot leave without... Bye-bye. Time for the greatest glitch. Well, it's not a glitch, it's... That sign is... Okay. Come on! Thank you. <laughs> Wait, I could have picked up the guns that were there. Yeah, watch this. So if you... For it! Okay, we're saving here. So if you, like, get here... Then you press this door. See? What? Okay. There's no point in shooting that. Same right here. And there's gonna be a zombie here. You kill it. Like that. Also, watch out for head crabs. No, I did not see that shot, because I was just killing a head crab. <laughs> Ow. That really hurt. No. This game isn't very long, if you know what you're doing. No! Yeah, the scientists screaming in this game are funny. How did you not die there? God, my ear itches. I'm gonna try and stream the entire game tonight. Because I have like a few tricks that I can do that can make me skip. Also, there's gonna be a head crab right there. Got him. Let's see? If you sp if you like spam jump, it makes it maybe a bit quicker. So watch out for this, because you have some barnacles up here. This game is really short, if you know where you're going and also what you're doing. 
Because if you don't know what you're doing, you're not going to get anywhere in this game. But there's actually a tr like a tutorial for this game, surprisingly. And the tutorial's pretty nice. You drop right here, kill that- Excuse me. That took a long time. You might as well kill him, because he's gonna die anyway. It's scripted. Okay. Are you guys ready for the most stupidest trick in this entire game? So you save here. Yes! Bye bye. So the entirety of this game. I keep saying game, it's chapter. Now you hear that thing? You're gonna see it right here. Yeah, there's three of them. Bye-bye. That's the bye-bye. Ow. See, like, when when you try and blast two hair like that, and you can take the health.